Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm going to show you how to restart Explorer when your computer crashes. So what Explorer is, is it shows all the desktop and the taskbar and stuff like that. So what happens when you have a crash, sometimes it disappears. Now I'm going to actually um, stop it myself and then I'm going to restart it. Okay, so what I'm going to do first, we're in, I'm in Windows Vista at the moment. Now, if I was in Windows XP, I would press Control Alt Delete, and that would bring Task Manager up. Now, in um, Windows Vista, I'm going to press Control Shift and Escape. Okay, and it brings up um, the Task Manager for me. If I press Control Alt Delete in Windows Vista, it logs me out and then lets me choose to open Windows Task Manager, but I don't want to do that because um, it'll break up my video. So we've got Windows Task Manager here. Now we want to go to Processes, okay? Because that that the pro they're the programs that I've got running, okay? Now I want to go to Processes. Now I want to go down to Explorer EXE and press on end process. Now I'm going to show you that all the desktop icons and the taskbar and all that are going to disappear. Yep, it's going to say do you really want to do this? Yep. Okay, so now I've got nothing. Nothing down the bottom. There's nothing anywhere. Okay, so just say my computer crashed and this is what happened. Well now I would be opening up task manager just the way I told you to uh, by pressing control shift and escape now I'm going to go to the applications tab now this is what I want this is how I'm going to restart Vista uh, the explorer.exe we're going to go to new task down the bottom and it's going to come up with this box and I'm just going to type explorer.exe and press OK that's how simple it is Okay, now if I go down, you can see that all my icons and my taskbars back. Okay, um, I hope that helped. Um, thanks for watching.